We heard a couple weeks ago that uh, there was talk of a referendum vote with the city of Oakland for the public to actually make the decision on Howard Terminal. And last check, maybe that would be even brought up tomorrow. Can you give us any update on the, on the referendum vote and, and your thoughts on it? I have not heard anyone taking that idea seriously, except the press enjoys talking about it. <laughs> um, I am not aware of any other council member besides the one who thinks that's a good idea. So I don't really think it's going to happen. I think it's a terrible idea. I think it is the council's responsibility to do the analysis. They are paid a full-time salary to represent the city, to make hard decisions. They have professional staff. They have access to experts. Uh, this is a very complicated project. And <laughs> there are no existing Oakland tax dollars going into this project. This, as it's proposed right now, all of the tax dollars would only be those generated by the project itself and only if the project happens. And even those tax dollars are only uh, available for public infrastructure and community benefits. Now, we've been very successful, and this project has helped us win competitive grants at the state and federal level. But if those dollars hadn't come to Oakland, they would have gone to another community. So um, we are very committed to not repeating the mistakes of the past. I'm going to look over. We can't see Mount Davis from here. But uh, Oakland has learned some very hard lessons about bad sports deals. We're not going to repeat them. We are going to be absolutely responsible with the taxpayer's dollar.